Right, this is for Eritrea and uh, Independence Day and uh, Mordecai and Kai, if you want to come up, and others from from uh, the delegation. I, I will read the, the proclamation and we'll pass it, and then um, Kai will have a few things to say. There you go. All right, ready? Okay, whereas Eritrea is a country that lies on the west coast of the Red Sea in the Horn of Africa, inhabited by a mosaic of nine ethnic communities, and whereas the eastern African state of Eritrea became independent on May 24, 1991, after a protracted 30-year war with Ethiopia and the mobilization of an impressive national movement, and... Whereas, Eritrea is one of the first of the sub-Saharan African nations to accept Christianity in the 4th century and Islam in the 7th century, and whereas, Eritrea's capital city, Asmara, is Africa's secret modernist city recognized by UNESCO, United Nations Educational, Scientific, and Cultural Organization, as a first world heritage site in Eritrea, and whereas, the state of Maryland has been enriched by the professional and economic contributions of Eritrean Americans. Now, therefore, the Mayor and Council of the City of Rockville, Maryland, hereby proclaim May 24, 2023, as Eritrean Independence Day in Rockville, and acknowledge the heroic determination of Eritrean people to live in peace and independence as sovereign people. Madam Mayor, I move the proclamation. Second. Motion's been made and seconded. All those in favor, please raise your hand. It is unanimous. All right. Uh, Kai, Kai is going to read uh, something first. Okay. Dear Mayor, Council, and the amazing staff members of the City of Rockville, I am honored to ex express my deepest appreci appreciation for the effort and help that all of you have provided to make this proclamation proclamation ceremony possible. Without your dedication and hard work, this event would not have been possible. Your unwavering support has ensured that our Eritrean community comes together to celebrate this crucial moment in our history, and we cannot thank you enough. Your willingness to go above and beyond to make this ceremony, ceremony truly memorable is a testament to your commitment to the people of Rockville. As we gather here to commemorate the 32nd Air Train Independence, let us take a moment to reflect on the tireless efforts, teamwork, and perseverance that have made this event possible. The spirit and determination that have gone into planning this proclamation ceremony will undoubtedly inspire individuals and organizations around our community. On behalf of our entire Air Train community, I extend my heartfelt gratitude to each and every one of you. Your hard work and dedication have made this ceremony possible, and we are extremely grateful for everything you have done. Thank you again for your exceptional service and commitment to the city of Rockville.